It was a bright winter morning, and the junior ranchers were up at dawn having fun on the Dino Ranch skating rink. While Blitz and Tango whirled like snowflakes. <laughs> and Clover's silly skating knocked them right off their feet. Little did the ranchers know that they were in for a very special surprise. <laughs> Here comes Brighty with her newborn baby Parasaur. There she is. It's baby Luna. Oops. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. Luna sure loves chasing snowflakes. She's never seen a snowflake before. Everything's exciting to a newborn baby dinosaur. <laughs> What's the matter, Brighty? <laughs> Wait, where did Luna go? She was just here a second ago. Luna! Luna, come on, girl! Luna! Biscuit is calling for the Dino Ranch Roundup. Let's go to Mon Pa. <laughs> Gather round, Rancheroos. There's a winter storm headed our way, and we need to get ready for it. That makes things even worse. Brady's baby just went missing. Oh, I'm sure Luna hasn't wandered far. While you go find her, your pa and I will herd all the other dinos into their barns. Okay, Ma. We'll bring Brady to help us. I'm sure Luna will hear her mama calling and come running. Good thinking, men. And don't worry, y'all will find little Luna. Let's rock it! Your mama's calling you, Luna! Luna! Luna, are you in here? Have any of you seen a baby parasaur go by? Never mind. Enjoy your breakfast. <laughs> Don't worry, Brighty. We'll find Luna before the storm hits. <laughs> Suffering saddle horns. Why doesn't Luna answer us? <laughs> Brighty sees her. Come on. Yes, there she is. Luna! That's strange. I've never seen a baby kind of not answer when their mom comes. Ah, there you are, Luna. You're quite the little adventurer. Time to go, Luna! <coughs> Luna, your mom is calling. <coughs> Luna just won't respond. <coughs> what are we doing wrong? Wait, I think I know what's going on. Come on, y'all. Let's take Luna to the Dino Care Center. Well, we've done all the tests, and according to our dino diagnosis, Min is absolutely right. Luna hasn't been ignoring us. She just can't hear us. Luna is deaf. Oh. If Luna can't hear us, we need to find a different way to communicate with her. Is that okay with you, Brighty? Let's make a dino difference. Let's see. Maybe Luna could hear something if it's really loud. Let's give it a try. What's the loudest thing we have around here? <laughs> Biscuit! Okay, Biscuit. We need you to let loose and roar as loud as you can. <laughs> I think we need a way to talk to Luna without using sounds. Mira, Luna 
responded to that. She felt the ground shake. Great idea, Biscuit. Yes, some dinosaurs communicate by using vibrations in the ground. This could work. Everybody, let's do the dino stomp. It's working. She's stopping that. should find a less shaky way to communicate with Luna. Okay, what else can we try? I have an idea. Look how Luna is drawn to sparkly snowflakes. And remember how she loved the twinkling glow jar lights? Yeah. What if we tried something that catches her attention that way? Like a dynamite light. That's it. Come on, Tango. We can do that. <laughs> Introducing... How does it work, Miguel? It uses different colors and shapes to mean different things. See? When you step on this pedal, the signal changes. This one is for danger. This one means stop. This one is go. And this one means inside. And this one is for treats. I think she likes it. Now all we have to do is teach Luna the rest of the symbols, so she knows what they all mean. I think we have time before the storm comes. If we hurry. Go, go, go! Now stop! Go! Now, it's time for treats! <laughs> Ooh, maybe we could teach Luna some sign language, too. Luna, this means love. Wow! She's so smart! Uh-oh, the wind is picking up. <laughs> The storm is on its way, ranchers. Y'all should make sure Bridie and Luna are tucked inside the barn with the other parasaurs. We're on it, Pa. Okay, Luna, it's time to go inside. <laughs> oh, no! John, use your dino collar. <laughs> it's no use. Our parasaurs can't hear us over the wind. The howling wind made it impossible for the frightened parasaurs to hear the call to come home. And the junior ranchers were worried until men saw that little Luna was trying to tell her something. Oh no, how will we bring them back? Luna, yes, what a clever little dino you are. The parasaurs can't hear us, but they will be able to see our Luna light. No, they're running onto the frozen watering hole. That ice isn't safe for a heavier of parasaurs. Luna! They're trying to help bring them back. We have to go after them. Hurry! Load up the Luna light!
right, Luna? Go! Yeehaw! Luna, you dino did it! Howdy, family. Ma! Pa! You should have seen the way Luna led the herd back to safety. Oh, we are so proud of you, Luna. And so is your mama. And we're proud of you all. That Luna light is a crackerjack invention. We made it to help Luna, but it actually helped all of our parasaurs. Thanks to our little dino hero here. <laughs> Yep, the Luna light became a permanent part of the Parasaur barn that day. And it just goes to show that a useful tool for some can be helpful to everyone. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Luna. Treats for everyone! <laughs> <laughs>